Princess Fawzi of Egypt, born on November 5, 1921, lived a life that could easily be mistaken for a fairy tale. With her stunning beauty and impeccable style, she captivated the world and was often compared to iconic stars like Hedy Lamarr and Vivian Lee. However, behind the glamour and elegance, her life was marked by challenges, including failed marriages and political upheaval. Join us as we delve into the extraordinary life of Princess Fazia, a woman who lost not one crown, but two. Early Years and Royal Lineage Princess Fazia was born into the esteemed Egyptian royal family as the eldest daughter of Sultan Fuadai of Egypt and Sudan, later known as King Fuadai. Her heritage was a rich tapestry of Egyptian and Albanian descent, which lent her a unique and captivating beauty. Growing up in the opulent Ras El Tin Palace in Alexandria, she was adored and cherished by her family. Her education took her to Switzerland, where she became fluent in Arabic, English, and French, setting the stage for her future as an international figure. A Royal Union, Fazia and Mohammad Reza Pahlavi the union between Princess Fazia and Crown Prince Mohammad Reza Pahlavi of Iran was not merely a love story but a marriage of political convenience. Orchestrated by the groom's father, Reza Shah, the marriage aimed to unite the historic House of Ali, which had ruled Egypt since 1805, with the relatively new Pahlavi dynasty in Iran. However, cultural and religious differences plagued the relationship from the start, making it an uphill battle for the young couple. King Farouk, Fazia's brother and the ruler of Egypt at the time, initially resisted the match. However, under pressure from his advisors, he eventually gave his consent, recognizing the potential benefits for Egypt's regional standing. The couple met only once before their grand wedding ceremony at Cairo's Abdeen Palace on March 15, 1939. The lavish affair, characteristic of King Farouk's love for opulence, included a sumptuous 20-course meal and captured the attention of the world. Life as Empress of Iran In 1941, Princess Fazia became Empress of Iran after her husband ascended to the throne following the exile of his father. However, the cultural differences and challenges she faced in her new role took a toll on her happiness. Having grown accustomed to the splendor of her brother's court in Egypt, Fazia found life in Iran underwhelming. She lamented the quality of the French food served at their wedding and compared the Iranian palaces unfavorably to the grandeur she had known in Egypt. Moreover, Fazia's relationship with her in-laws was strained, with her sisters-in-law even resorting to physical violence. Meanwhile, Mohammad Reza Shah engaged in multiple extramarital affairs, causing further anguish for Fazia. As her dissatisfaction grew, she withdrew from royal life, speaking only in French and seeking solace in the care of an American psychiatrist who diagnosed her with depression. The End of a Royal Marriage News of Princess Fazia's unhappiness reached her family in Egypt, leading to their intervention. Concerned about her deteriorating health, her brother, King Farouk, urged her to return home. In 1945, Fazia left Iran, and a divorce was granted in 1948, allowing her to regain her status as Princess of Egypt. However, her daughter, Princess Shanaz Pahlavi, remained in Iran, a painful separation that added to Fazia's losses. Just a year after her divorce, Fazia found love again. In 1949, she married Egyptian aristocrat Colonel Ismail Kyrene, marking the beginning of a happier chapter in her life. The couple went on to have a son and a daughter, enjoying a genuine love match that brought Fazia the happiness and stability she longed for. Life after royalty and legacy The House of Ali was overthrown in 1952 during the Egyptian Revolution, but Princess Fazia chose to remain in Egypt, despite the loss of her royal status. She continued to live a life of grace and elegance, embodying the essence of a true royal. Fazia's famous remark, I have not lost one crown, but two, reflects her resilience and strength as she navigated the challenges that life presented her. Princess Fazia passed away on July 2, 2013, at the age of 91. Her life serves as a testament to the complexities of royal marriages, the influence of politics on personal lives, and the enduring spirit of a woman who faced adversity with grace. 
Though her crown may have slipped away, the memory of Princess Fazia lives on as an emblem of resilience, beauty, and the indomitable spirit of a true princess. To sum up, Princess Fazia of Egypt's life was a tapestry of royalty, glamour, and heartache. From her early years in the Ras El Tin Palace to her ill-fated marriage to the Shah of Iran, she experienced the highs and lows of a life lived in the public eye. Despite the challenges she faced, Fazia's strength and resilience shone through, ultimately leading her to find love and happiness in her second marriage. Her legacy as a woman who lost not one, but two crowns, serves as a reminder of the complexities of royal life and the indomitable spirit of a true princess. Click here to watch Morocco's youngest princess at just 15 makes waves with impressive accomplishments. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe for more videos on interesting topics like this.